Rich, Resident Evil 4, the remake, mm. is out in... I want to say it's the 27th of March of this month, Rich. Was you want to say that? I wouldn't, because you're three days no. out. It's the 24th. Yeah. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Yeah. But yeah, so... Um, We've had another look at it recently. This will be the last preview, I assume. Otherwise, yeah. it's just a really bizarre to have one mm-hmm. um, after this. Um, but yeah, just some more gameplay. A little bit more um, combat orientated, a little bit more diversity, different locations yep. than the last time we saw it, which actually wasn't that long ago either, was it? No, it was a couple of months ago. Uh, actually, yeah. it was October? more than a couple of months ago. October, yeah, geez, time's flying. Um, but yeah. this is uh, slightly later into the game, so this is after um, you've been to the church, it's chapter 4. Um, so if you have played the original, you'll sort of know roughly where this is, but I'm getting the impression that this is significantly significantly, sorry, expanded. Um, Do you reckon? Based Mate, on I can't remember, I can't actually remember Resi 4 at all. It's been that long. I don't think I've actually played it since it came out originally. Well, I, I've played this oh, countless I times. I play it. I mean, not this, but the original, obviously. Yeah, Lee playing yeah. it was fun to watch. Um, but yeah, it's one of those that I still... I go back to it, and I seem to have forgotten loads of stuff. Um, even though I must have played it six, seven, eight times, probably. On oh, various really? platforms. Yeah, yeah, easily. Well, um, this is one of your kind of franchises, right? I love Resident Evil, yeah, absolutely. Oh, mate, that's um, going to hurt. And I'm really excited about this as well. Yeah, it gets absolutely hammered in this um, gameplay, Leon. Um, but hey, I guess he can take it. Yeah, this is the this is the game that sent Resi on an action adventure um, journey, right? Well, it's easy to forget that this was kind of revolutionary. Like that over the shoulder third person kind of viewpoint wasn't that common. Um, oh yeah, I keep forgetting that. So, oh yeah, because yeah. like obviously with two and three, mm-hmm. um, different viewpoints. Still that fixed camera, yeah. So this was like a it was a bit of a revolution for the series and. For games in general, I think, and uh, I mean, it was a weird one, right? Whether to remake this or not, because the old one still holds up so much. But looking at this, I'm sort of happy they are. Yeah, we're getting to that period, like where remakes almost aren't necessary unless you change it significantly. Yeah, and a I think a little bit like Dead that. Space, right? Yeah, Dead Space. See, that that was a good remake, and I think this is in that kind of dead space vein and um, I don't know if back there by the way you saw um, one of the Ganados throwing a torch at you and Leon deflected it with oh, his knife I did see that yeah I saw that when editing actually I was like oh yeah. that's actually pretty cool so the knife is like really yeah. versatile now so you can use it to counterattack anything even like okay. um, Dr. Salvador's chainsaw you can deflect oh, really? that yeah it's nuts it's really mad um, but weirdly this is one of the things that I remember like mm-hmm. not specifically this bit but once you get into the church like, I remember that yeah just mainly because it was the, not the church the cathedral the castle right yeah the castle whatever you want to call it the castle um, um, yeah when the game kind of shifts gears yeah that's it yeah because mm-hmm. then is it before or after you have to shoot the driver in the truck it's just before, before isn't it? yeah it's on the path to the castle that bit yeah um, yeah so that's the stuff I actually do remember everything else I have yeah can't remember at all mm. yeah. so this is kind of yeah this is almost perfect for me that it's almost going to be like playing a new game. Yeah, yeah. And also, um, they've changed the Ashley stuff, so she was kind of helpless in the original. But in this now, you can tell her to... Oh, right? Exactly, yeah, really annoying. But you can tell her to back off now. So you see, by your health gauge, is that little kind of outline of you and Ashley. So she's away now, she's giving you space, she backs off to let you do your stuff, and then you can tell her to come back. she just get getting killed. Exactly, she'd get killed, she'd get in the way. But now you can be like, yeah. back off, Ashley, and then you can tell her to start following you again. So, yeah, I like that. It's a good touch. She seems a lot that is more a nice um, touch. helpful as well. I think she sort of lets you into doors and stuff that you can't uh, unlock from the other side or whatever. Yeah, I, think, um, I don't know whether I cut it out, because we had like 16 minutes of B-roll, and we had to mm. can only show 10, basically, so yeah. I had to chop some stuff out. So I went with... Um, the iconic stuff, like yeah. less of the slow walking, which a lot of the B-roll was quite just slow walking. You know, like the um, yeah the game dev walk that's got the slow pan as well. Yeah, yeah I know exactly like, what you mean. It was like yeah, that's but, um, um, those are the bits where you sort of walk into the forest, aren't they? And you can just hear the whispers in the trees, kind of the far off kind of 
Sorry. weird whispering, which I think is yeah, y- super cool. It's but it doesn't it know, doesn't lend itself well to this sort of uh, thing, does it? No, especially when we're talking over the top. It's yeah. like, hey, c- everyone, be quiet for a minute. Listen <laughs> to the whispers, and we just go silent. It just wouldn't work. Yeah, so. just trust us. There's, there's whispering. It's scary. It's atmospheric. <laughs> It'll work in the context of the game, but not in the context of a video like this. No, um, exactly. Unless it's just straight up gameplay, but we're not yeah. allowed to do that, obviously. Um, so, and yeah. we, um, but yeah, we also cut out the Krauser knife fight, didn't we? Which in the original was a QTE, a horrible QTE. That if you missed Is the press, wh- you 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 failed it. But in this, it's a real time knife fight. I almost want to argue it's worse. You reckon? Oh no way! Yeah. I much. I it's, think it's, I'm going to much it's prefer like, that. Like you just, you just have to parry it, right? Right. There's no insta fail state. No, I QTE, guess that is the annoying the thing press. from the original. Yeah, it's yeah. like, oh god, I've got to do it again, you know. But like, I just, you're basically there, and you're having to parry and like knife him. I just, I feel like they, that could have just been a cutscene. Well, you're quite like good personally. at parrying, aren't you? You're a, you know, souls like aficionado. Yeah, you know how to do a good parry. You'll be all right. Yeah, it just seems pointless though. Like in. in in my eyes but we cut that out anyway so yeah. you won't see how pointless it is no. until the game comes <laughs> just out just take a word for it yeah, yeah exactly <laughs> but basically yeah it's no QTE anymore you are just mm-hmm. basically meleeing and, and just hitting the parry yeah um, you can evade as well there's um, a really oh, cool yeah, little duck uh, so I think it happens later when an enemy I'm not going to give it away because it's a cool enemy who returns you probably know already give it away of a, of, a, of a game yeah that, uh, <laughs> it was out. Was fifteen years? No, two thousand five. No. It's oh, okay. No. Eighteen years. Yeah. Jesus. Wow. It feels like wow. only yesterday I wrote a fifteen-year retrospective on this. But um, there we go, man. No, Rich. That was three years ago. Three years ago. That was during COVID as well, wasn't it? Yeah, actually? yeah, yeah. Oh wow. What's happened for the last three years? What time? But this is it. This is the thing that I remember like more than anything. Mm, Salazar. Um, yeah. yeah, well, just these interiors as well. So obviously, look at look what they've done to it. Mm. Like mm-hmm. it, yeah. If you go back and play it now, like the 2005 game, yeah, this looks. This area doesn't look fantastic, but now, Rich, it looks phenomenal. Although I would question everybody's dress sense here. <laughs> like, well, this is I mean, the thing. They're weird, aren't they? Salazar, you know, his campy, weird villain. Well, he has got his tricorn like, hat, though. Where's his tricorn hat? I just hat? wasn't talking about Salazar, either. Like, look, look at that, the orange blazer. It's just... You don't think it's very President's Daughter, no? No. Who's, when was the last time you saw a President's Daughter, or anyone, wear an orange blazer? I or orange know. in general? Do people wear orange? This is where everyone in the chat's going to be, uh, actually... It might be super fashionable. Okay. I don't know. Yeah, but this I remember this as well. Did you see a duck in to get out of the way? Yeah, good. It's pretty cool. Yeah, good stuff. Because there is, no, I will say, there's nothing more annoying in video games than um, basically NPCs or like squad members mm-hmm. just getting in the way. Yeah, like, absolutely. Nothing more absolutely frustrating, irritating. Um, but yeah, there was the parry rich. that as well. It's good, isn't it? It's good. Yeah, I'm it's probably gonna be right. rubbish at that. Yeah, just, but I mean, I probably won't use it just because I'm not used to using it. Do you know what I mean? I think I will. Um, when I went hands on with it in October, I, I did find myself using it quite a bit. Just it is definitely useful to it. The only thing is that the knife has a, a lifespan, it's got its own little sort of health bar. So they break oh, okay. eventually and they're quite hard to come by. I think you can buy them from the merchants and you can find them. Weapon degradation about. as well. I hate that. Well, it's only on your knife, I suppose. But it's like just in games tool. in general. In in general. I'm not a fan like, either. But in this but also torches you know. that don't have, have batteries is annoying as well. Like, that don't just have get batteries. a list out of No, like Really? I've got a torch that'll last longer than an eight hour video game. Oh uh, right, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Alan Wake then, you love that. <laughs> yeah, I do actually love Alan Wake. Well, but yeah, that really did annoy me. But uh, see that nice little thing. And as you'll know, that's one of my favourite games of all time. I so. do know that. I do know that. It's so. ironic that one of my favourite games of all time has yeah. one of my, my most hated mechanics <laughs> so Dan this is the Garador remember him he's fun isn't he yeah um, so he's it's he can't see you but um, Jesus if he hits you you're uh, you're in deep shit yeah it's Mutant Wolverine yeah he's badass oh god 
I remember this freaked me out. But yeah, Rich, when's it out? Again, March 24th? March 24th for Xbox Series X, uh, PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4 and PC. No Xbox One version. But yeah, March 24th, look forward to it.